first part of our educational video is cardiac surgery made simple, presented by Dresden Heart Center in Germany. Today the surgeon is Dr. Utz Kappert, the senior consultant in our center, and this is Ahmed Oda, the first assistant during this operation. As you can see, we have just performed a jump bypass to the circumflex and the marginal arteries and Lima bypass to the LAD, and we'd like to show you how to perform a T-graft anastomosis in a very simple way. Before suturing, there are some very important hints. Uh, as you can see, number one, the anastomosis site should be intrapericardial to avoid kinking against the pericardial edge after closing the pericardium. Number two, cutting the vein should be performed in about 30 degrees angle to avoid very vertical orientation of the anastomosis, which may lead to kinking. And number three, as you can see, the incision in the lima side must be identical to the opening of the vein end to avoid distortion of the geometry of the anastomosis. Inciting the lima, then extending the incision with the pot scissor to be just equal to the diameter of the vein. We begin to shrink from 3 o'clock position at the vein side and coming out from the just anterior to the right angle of the lima incision. Continuing suturing in a clockwise manner giving about three or four stitches for every quarter of the vein circumference. By reaching the heel of the vein, you should come out from the 12 o'clock position from the lima side. It's very important to mention that um, you should avoid guiding the suture by the assistant uh, because any extra traction may uh, distract the lima side. Then proceed till you reach in 9 o'clock position on the vein side and coming out just anterior to the left angle of the lima incision. Pulling the vein down in a parachute manner. As you can see, the length of the uh, lima incision and the vein opening are identical. Proceeding in a forehand manner till reaching the right angle of the lima incision. Light traction on the adventitia of the lima uh, will facilitate uninterrupted suturing.
now you can cross beyond the first stitch testing the anastomosis now the bulldog will be released and tying the anastomosis will be done just to stop the bleeding and uh, uh, any uh, extra traction on the suture uh, should be avoided to avoid any distortion of the geometry of the lima bypass which may cause uh, stenosis at this side of the lima Real nice result.